Hi guys and welcome to TechBase. In this video, we're going to talk about an all-in-one PDF tool that you can use to edit your PDF documents with ease, use OCR functions and converting features alongside with EA features, for example, summarized Q&A and generated content inside your PDF documents. If you're interested in all of those, well, you've come to the right video because today we're going to talk about Tenorshare PD knob, which is in my opinion, one of the best, if not the best PDF tool that you can use in Windows 11 25H2. You can also get the free version if you want to test out all of those features first so let's just do that we're gonna get it first and then install Tenorshare PD knob here just accept the terms and then click on the install button to successfully install the software after the installation process is finished of course we can also set up Tenorshare PD knob as the default application to open PDF files and now we are free to test out PD knob for ourselves and let's go through some of the main functions and features that you can use in this software first of all let's open up a PDF document I'm gonna go in and select file and then click on open and from my desktop, I'm just going to open up this sample PDF document. And then we're going to go into the edit section up top to test out all the editing features that we have. For example, let's add a text, click on this section, select the location where you want to add the text. And I'm going to add the text text based. And from the right side, you can change the font if you want. For example, let's select this font. And then we can also switch up the size. We can increase the size if we want. And we have a whole bunch of other in-depth features that we can use. For example, line spacing and char spacing. In addition to this, we can also add an image. So let's just go ahead and select an image. I'm just going to add an image from here, a quick screenshot. And once it is added, we can select the location in the PDF page where we want to add it, for example, here. And then we can resize it if we want. We can move it around in the PDF page. You can also select a lock aspect ratio so you can quickly resize it without losing its ratio and you have other options such as extract and replace and rotate right or left if you want to change the way the image looks in the PDF document we can also add a link let's click on link and then add slash edit link and select the location where we want to add the link and I'm gonna select the image and then we're gonna select open a web page and insert here youtube.com slash tech based my youtube channel you can also change up the appearance if you want the border the thickness and also the color. Let's click on apply. And as you can see, the link is now applied to this image. You can also crop the image. I'm going to crop it into the left side a bit. And you also have other options in the right side, unit, margin controls, page range and more, and then click on crop. And we can also add a watermark if we want. Click on add watermark. I'm just going to select text. Again, the text tech based. Then we can change the appearance a bit, move it to 50% transparency and add a 45 degree angle. And if you want to low, you can also switch up the position page range and more let's click on save and you can also add a background the same way you added a watermark if you want alongside with the option to customize the header and footer of this pdf document finally you have Bates number which you can also edit as easy as that with a lot of customization options that you can do and i'm just going to click on save next up we're going to test out the ocr function or the ability of this software to convert an image with text into editable text and tenorshare pdnav has a 99 percent accuracy so let's just test that out we're going to go into the page section and then we're going to insert another page and then click on insert blank page and then we're going to click on insert for it to be inserted after let's click on edit and below in the second page let's add an image and i have here an image inside the picture section with a lot of text let's add it here inside the pdf document and then we're going to use the ocr function by going into home and then click on ocr we're going to have to save the pdf document first click on yes and then we're just going to have to get the ocr plugin so for that just wait a few seconds once you got the plugin, this section will pop up and we can select the output format, for example, scan to editable text. And you can also select the page range if you want all the pages or only the current page. And then we're going to click on perform OCR. It's going to process the page of this PDF document and select every text from the page that we have. And as you can see, it successfully selected every text and we can edit it out if we want inside this PDF document as easy as that. I think this is a very nice function that can be used. And as I've said, it has a 99% accuracy. We also have format conversion inside Tenorshare PD knob. If we go into the convert section, we can create a PDF from scratch or we can convert it to Word, Excel, PowerPoint, image, PDFA, and more. In addition to this, we also have batch convert, which you can use to convert multiple PDF documents at the same time, which I think is a pretty cool feature. As an example, I'm just going to convert the whole PDF document to an image. I'm just going to select to image and here we can select the pages. We have the page range one to two, and then we have the format. I'm just going to leave it as JPEG, select the source directory custom and save it to the desktop. 
then click on convert and it should be successfully converted into two different images as you can see that are keeping their quality pretty well if you ask me we also have some AI functions as I've said the AI chat if you click on the AI sidebar you're gonna have the PDNAB AI which will be basically built-in chat GPT and DeepSeek that you can use for summarize Q&A and generate content inside your PDF documents just click on the start button and you should be good to go it's gonna upload our PDF document to AI and with this as I've said you can do a lot of tasks for example I just asked it please summarize the document in two sentences and it successfully did that I think this is also pretty cool and from below here you can change the AI chat GPT 4 or DeepSeek if you want Tenor share PD knob also has a very good cross platform so you can use it on both Windows and Mac with a good support if you switch between those and also you won't ever see watermarks on your documents and to test out all the professional features of course you can pay a lifetime fee to always have them compared to some other products such as Adobe Acrobat which is a few hundred dollars per year as I've said if you want to try out Tenor share PD knob for yourself make sure to check out the description below for additional information and you're gonna be able to use all the functions such as the edit OCR AI features for PDF documents and if you want to try out all those first you can also get the free version so this was the video for today I hope you liked it if you did please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one I was Imani from tech base until next time have a nice day